make no mistake, this is no dress rehearsal. It is the real thing. We are ready for action in the group stage. Stay with us for every kick of the ball right here on EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the group stage for these two nations here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Brazil versus Panama. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. The starting 11 for Brazil. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. And the lineup for Panama. Well, it's a very defensive system which doesn't allow them to press the ball high up the field. So they need to stay compact, win back possession, and then counter attack from there. It's not going to be easy, though. And so the match is underway. Borges. Da Costa. Marta. Now with Borges. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Erika Hernandez. Salazar. Patient build up at the moment. Firing it towards goal. Well, how close it was. And she knows it. Marta. Now with Caroline. Marta. Going well. Oh, big chance. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here we can see it again. It's a beautifully weighted ball behind the back line, and the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top-quality goal.
1 0 then. Can they create something from here? And not quite on target. Unfortunate, you've got to say. Yeah, a little bit unfortunate. It's good technique. She makes good contact, but it needs to be on target to trouble the keeper. Sabinha, Marta, Karina Baltri Preyes. Good work from Brazil to win back possession. Gaze, Sanarato. Brazil now in a potentially dangerous position. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Could cross it in here. Has a go. Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. And the short option preferred. An alert piece of defending. A deft clearance. Hernandez. Hilary Jaén. Daisy Ray Salazar. Good looking play as she tries to get them onto the front foot. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Daisy Ray Salazar. Oh, good vision. And still danger here. And a time for calm on the ball. Tamires. A really intense pressure applied. Tabinha. Big chance! Terrific block there. Well, no damage done. Caen. Hernandez. It needs an accurate cross. Not trailing, but plenty of time left and a corner coming up. Who can they pick out? Oh, a splendid header, but a fine save. They tried to build ahead of steam. Another corner it'll be. Smuggled away. Well, shielding the ball admirably. But just like that, possession changes hands. Raffaele. Caroline. Marta. Devinha. 
and the electronic board showing one additional minute and beating her marker Ari Borges it might be they've gone and scored again they're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back Well, look at this again, because this is a really well-worked goal. The passing is incisive, the movement of the ball is bright, and it leads to a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a great goal. And with that, the first half draws to a close. So back in business here, and no two ways about it. It was an eye-catching first-half performance from Brazil. Are they capable of matching that in the second half? Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Erika Hernandez. Moving forward effectively. A disappointing end to the move. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Options in the centre. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Gazing. Antonia da Costa. Good movement. Borges. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, full marks for trying, but very deftly cut out. The high press was very much on. Cox. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. Well, there it is. Brazil have controlled the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Zanarato. Not showing good vision. Good technique displayed. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. And they're making a change. Brazil now in a potentially dangerous position. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Hernandez. Marta Cox. Debinha. Failure to keep the ball by Brazil. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Well, she really deserves credit for that challenge. Marta Cox. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, it fizzled out. Marta. Tamires. 
Zanarato has eyes for goal and foiled only by the crossbar and keeper's ball in the end well look at the relief out there that looked a certain goal didn't it well they won't come much closer than that it's a matter of inches from being a really good goal but it should boost their confidence but they can't afford to drop their guard at the other end moving the ball forward with purpose now Gonzalez a very effective challenge put in ten minutes to go Kerodin Marta Devinha and a good looking pass Good physical play. Espinosa. Cayenne. How can they exploit the space out wide? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Catalan. Sabinha, Luana, well just trying to drive her team forward here, well it would have been a chance, but the run was mistimed, offside, well they've decided to make a change, There will be one minute added on at the end. And full time, Brazil have prevailed. That's the big story here. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It was a great performance.